you're the hardest working people in show business. Oh, I mean, stop. You, you are. You start the network in we the morning it? and you're closing We're it with the it down. Shutting it down with the Tonight Show. Come on. Come on. Uh, I, I, uh, thank you again for coming back. Love I always you. love seeing you. I watch you every single day. You finally got a little time off during the holiday. We did. A break. Oh, What'd my you do? God. Okay, so Jimmy, I took my two girls, Haley and Hope, to Universal. They're the cutest kids. First of all, they met you here yeah. and they adore you. So, so when we were walking around, I go, oh, look, there's a Jimmy Fallon ride. I have my own ride. Wait, you have your own? Oh, you yeah. Have you all ever been on it? It's okay. scary. Okay, it's really fun. So my three-year-old put the glasses on. You get locked in. It's yeah. like you're in The Tonight Show. Jimmy. <laughs> She's, she was terrified. She is, like, scarred. I don't she, think she can no, do that. She loved you, She's but now... Young. I don't, yeah, she Did just she, throw made, up? she just made the height. Yeah. She didn't understand throw up. what was happening. Jimmy, she was terrified. She kept going, "Where's Jimmy? Where's Jimmy? No, get me out! Get me out! Get me out!" And you can't get out once no. you're in. It's, just it's, like the Tonight Show. Yeah, they're all strapped <laughs> in. They're not allowed to leave. It was, by the way, it was super fun. Oh, but she no, was way my too gosh. little. But you have to, you have to like have come to, and hug her. Yeah, right, get Next time, bring her over. Yeah, okay. yeah, I'll come by and see you. How about you? Have a birthday around Christmas. Yes, I do. The coveted two days after Christmas birthday, and when everybody was really in the mood to celebrate. Yeah. And I also, I turned 51. Oh my which gosh, is happy so birthday. not exciting. Yes, come yes, on. exciting. But my little boy asked me literally the other day, you know how when they're little, they're like, they have the four-year-old visit, the five-year-old visit. My little boy goes, Mommy, did you have your 51-year-old visit? Oh, no. <laughs> I know, and I was like, yeah, they weighed and measured me, and I got the shingles vaccine. Yeah. Oh my God. So we did that, and it was fun. It was fun, little yeah. family time. Did you get any good gifts? You know what the cutest thing is? The kids actually wrote down what they liked about me, which is oh really. My God. Are you I know, joking? I know, and um, I think they were like, you know, prompted to do yeah. that. Um, but my little boy said I smelled good. Oh, and hey. Yes. And my daughter said um, she acts like a little girl, <laughs> and that I sing but badly. <laughs> no, yes. that was still you take I know, it. That's it was so good. cute. Yeah. Come on. Uh, but uh, before we talk about the five years, I want to talk about your your new podcast. Talk to me about this. Making By the way, space. I love this podcast, Jimmy. There are certain things you do and you're crazy about. This whole this podcast is all kind of inspirational leaders and teachers. So you love I, that you're good at it. You love that. I'm so I'm so in. I feel like if I wasn't if I wasn't doing the podcast, like I'd be listening to it. But we had this lady on named Mel Robbins, who's a very like she's a motivational speaker. Yeah. And she was saying to she was saying, look. In the new year, you should do, you can start off by this resolution. She said, the very first decision you make every morning when you wake up, the very, very first decision when your alarm goes off, is you're going to decide whether or not you're going to procrastinate to start your day or you're going to hop up. She said, the very first decision you make in the morning never, ever hits news. Feet on the floor, get up, get into the shower right away. Make your bed right away and she said once you do those things I don't know. once you do those I don't know about Jimmy this. that means the <laughs> whole I, I might do the first one but I can't do both things <laughs> no, that's too much. feels like I'm in the that's a lot uh, yeah the yeah. Ar armed forces uh, I want to I want to talk about uh, today uh -huh. okay this is uh this is a uh, uh, a landmark show, uh, obviously, uh, one of the uh, Tonight Show, Today Show. Uh, recently, we lost a, a legend, uh, uh, journalist, uh, Barbara Walters, who was on the Today Show for 15 years. Mm -hmm. uh, what, what, what did her legacy leave behind? What did she mean to you guys? Well, she, I think she said it best when we, a few years ago, when she retired from The View, they invited newswomen past and present, and mm -hmm. everyone walked out and surprised her. And I mean, everybody was there. Oprah mm -hmm. was there, uh, everyone. Mm -hmm. And Barbara looked around and she said, you guys are my legacy. Yeah. And I think we know that that is true. I mean, at the Today Show in particular, we're not here without Barbara Walters knocking down that door and doing it when there was no precedent, there was no example, there was no representation of, of that path. She did it. She blazed the trail like a pioneer. We are able to sit and have two women anchoring together, which is now totally normal because of what but Barbara what did, the, did. Yeah, you say Barbara Walters. Yeah, yeah, of course, she yeah. was a trailblazer. But d think about that. That's five years of doing this together. When you first... Uh, we're sat together and you yeah. opened the Today Show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did it feel like a moment to you? It felt like a moment, but not because it was two women. It was because it was us. Yeah. You know, it was just, it was, we literally held hands and yeah. said, let's do this. Let's go. 
You yeah. know, and it was But it was, was just, a moment for women, I would think. I think it was. We didn't realize it, because I remember I went to a Soul Cycle spin class, and I walked in shortly after uh, Savannah and I had started, and I sat in the same seat I always sit in, uh -huh. in Sue's Soul, Soul Cycle class, and I sat in my chair, and people started clapping. I was like, oh my God, someone has a birthday. You know, they always do, you know how they do. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah those bike class, they root for each other. Yeah, you, you, you got yeah. it, yeah. You got it, yeah. 50 looks good. Yeah. Anyway, and as I was sitting, I was looking around, and they were looking at me, and I said, I go, what, what's going on? And they go, what you and Savannah did today. It was big. It was big. I, and I told Savannah, I said, oh my God, it mattered. Like, we didn't realize, I think, in the moment that it did. And now... Have you seen things change since you've started? You know, one thing that we notice yeah. a lot is in local news, which yeah. we came up in local news. Yeah. You know, if you if what somebody was gone and you needed to step, it was always a, a guy and a girl. Yeah. It was a man yeah. and a woman. It was like Dina and Todd or yeah. whoever and Heather. Yeah. They would never put two women. They would never say, oh, Todd's off tonight. Hoda, can you fill yeah. in Savannah? Yeah. No, no, we can't have two, two women. women. Now we notice, because we do all these affiliate crosstalks, so we see it in local news all the time. There are a lot of female yeah. partnerships. So I don't know if that's... Be uh, probably not because of us, but it, now it's just more normal. I and think, I think yeah. that's really cool. I think it is it. because of you guys, yeah. And by, Todd yeah. shouldn't take all that time off. No, exactly <laughs> right, yeah. And you know what else is really cool? Yeah. Guess who's coming back tomorrow, Jimmy, on our show? Al. Guess who's coming back? Al Roker? Yes! Al, Al Roker is back! Yeah. We love you, Al. No, 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 I'm that's gonna be, I'm gonna lose time? it. I love it, I'm gonna lose it. I, know I love that guy so much. such cool videos He's such a good guy. I can't wait, all right, good, I'll try to, Watch them. I'll come in tomorrow early just no, to say hi to not. You'll have to wake up in the morning I won't hit snooze, hours. yeah, exactly. But really, I wanted to uh, thank you for coming on the show again, but also thank you for what you're doing and what you've done. Five years, this is massive, what you're doing, and you're the best. I watch you every morning. You're the greatest. Thank you Jimmy, guys so much. Jimmy, we love you. I we love, love you. you. Savannah Guthrie, hold a copy. No one better. Right here at the Today Show on NBC. We'll be right back with Colin Quinn, everybody. Stick around. Hey, hey.